Welcome back to another adventure. Uh, today I was kind of striking out. Uh, been to a couple of mines. Uh, one of them was collapsed. The other turned out to be just like a 20 foot added alongside the road. So um, I didn't uh, even bother with it. But um, finally got up here and uh, saw this uh, waste rock pile from the road. There, I saw an added on the um, on the map, so I was kind of looking for it, and then I saw this tailings pile and got up here, and uh, sure enough, there is an adit right there. Um, looks to be open, um, which is good. Uh, doesn't look like it'd be too crazy, but there is a pretty decent size uh, tailings pile here. Um, not sure really what uh, mine this is. Um, like I said, I was just out looking at a couple other mines and um, was kind of looking around at what else I could check out when nothing else panned out. So um, I'm going to call this one the, the rock cut uh, mine. That's the general area it's in. Um, I know there is a rock cut mine up here, um, but I'm not sure if the, this is it. But uh, yeah, so we'll go ahead and get all suited up and head right, in there. So uh, here we are at the adit. Um, little trench leading out. That's uh, the uh, waste rock pile out there. And uh, Looks like it's open. Oh yeah, open and not collapsed. So well, that's two good things. A little bit of wood in here and stuff. Um, oh, little frog. That's cool. See them every once in a while in the in the mines. But uh, oh yeah, there's a bunch of them. Another one right there. Uh, sitting on some calcite. Get some better light on that. That's a pretty cool picture. Um, yeah, there's some calcite flow on the the ceiling and walls in here and everything. Try and get through here without stepping on any frogs. Um, it's a pretty cool calcite flow it's got going on here. Um, pretty thick and everything. Some little some stalactites up there looking pretty cool. Let's see if I can, there we go, focus on those. And uh, we'll continue on. Looks like it just kind of zigzags a little. Probably looking for a vein. There's supposed to be, oh yeah, there's a split. Nice. I'm yeah, pretty sure that was my boot. Um, oh yeah. So, uh, yeah, there's two adits on the map and uh, uh, one shaft and a prospect. So this might actually turn out to be something decent. Um, had a bunch of kind of rotten wood there. Oh, I had some kind of pack rat, big old pack rat nest back here. We got some rail, though. Not sure we don't have any. Oh, oh that's a sharp bend. Huh. Uh, so yeah, there's some, let me zoom out there a little bit, some uh, rail down around the corner here. And then we've got a little pack rat pocket right here. And it keeps going. Still got the ties down. Looks like they just left those uh, rails around the corner because they couldn't use them anywhere else. But with the amount of ties that are in here, I kind of think this might turn into something cool. I'll go ahead and zoom back in a little bit. Mm -hmm. This keeps going. That's cool. And getting into some calcite on the on the floor here. Oh wow, yeah. another split. Uh, we're going to take the right here. I think it might end. Yeah, this is cool. Huh. Turned out. A uh, little bit of um, wood going on there. That's some really cool calcite flow there. I don't know if that'll uh, focus very well, but really wet oh yeah look at those that is cool really cool 
Uh, keeps on, uh, looks like we might hit a face here, which is fine. There's plenty more to, plenty more to see in here. There's a bunch of calcite there. It's like the, it came up to the top of the water level there or whatever. And, uh, all the water dried up, but it's pretty thick in here. Those, uh, stalactites are pretty cool there. Let me see if I can get a decent, couple decent pictures of that while I'm back here. Uh, yeah, it's just dripping from the ceiling there. That's pretty cool. I think this is a side branch too, so we'll take the next right again, keeping with the right hand rule on this one because it's not sure what to expect. Um, we've got a little six there on the, on the wall. And then it heads back this way. A little bit of rail in the corner again. That's cool. Oh wow, this might turn out to be a decent one. Makes up for uh, the others I found, but uh, got the rail down in here still. Got some boards down so the miners could walk. Uh, more stalactites there. This might even come back to the bottom of the, the shaft. Well, we got another split here. We got a jaw from something, probably a deer. And what's that? This big formation here of. Uh, Calcite flow coming down. Really, really long stalactites in this one. Um, but that's pretty cool. We're going to take this right again. Keep taking the right. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, man. Okay, looks like it faces going both ways here. But. Yeah, there's a face. Nope. Okay, there's the face. So there's a face. There's a face. Um, got some kind of glittery stuff going on back here. Lots of blasting dust, though. A um, little bit of something going on there with some sulfides. And we'll head back this way. Take that next right. Little pack rat nest back here. I haven't really seen any pack rats yet though, but there's a face there. Um, yeah. That's really cool. All that all that stuff flowing and everything. But, oh, I keep coming in this way, take the next right continue on this main branch here. These uh, boards are pretty slick, so I'm having a hard time uh, kind of staying upright, I guess. Oh, there's the first pack rat. And a little bit of luminescence on the water there. Looks like that was probably a, a stoped area that they um, backfilled, gobbed it shut. Kind of getting into a little narrower passage here, so I think we're probably getting closer to the end. All the rails still in here, that's cool. Seems uh, pretty accessible too, so I'm really surprised that there's not a gate on it or anything. Which is good, it keeps, <laughs> yeah, the top's really narrow. I'm having to kind of duck just so I don't bounce off the walls, but God, it keeps going. Um, another branch. More calcite, real thick, all the way up to the top of the rails there. 
kind of odd. That looks like. Okay, there's a face. Wait, is that? No. Oh, that was daylight there for a second. Something really yellow. Oh. Oh no. Oh, it's just a. You know, lots of calcite back here and everything. Got a dynamite box there. Uh, some kind of. That's a piece of steel there. It's stuck in the calcite. That's that's cool. Um, it's kind of got a little bit of a focus on that. A little bit of a tip end on it. Um, so it might have been a, a blasting spoon. And it kind of looks like uh, that was probably what they were going after. And I don't know if this all... It almost looks gobbed in there, though. Right in there. Like it's been stacked, but uh, whether the miners actually even saw that when they were in here. Got a piece of tin, a couple of pieces of tin. Oh, we're getting back to more water. Huh. Uh, we got this. What that signifies. Lots of tin. We're into getting into some. Oh wow! Major calcite back here. And more water, standing water. We'll see. Yeah, this one's got almost more calcite than the uh, the red top did. Keeps going. That's cool. Okay, this is the face it looks like. Um, there's like a little channel right there. Uh, that right there is the rail actually. And uh, the rail, yeah. So there's the, uh, there's the face. Got some more miners graffiti there. Uh, lots of sulfides and stuff back here. And a big quartz. I think that's quartz, not uh, calcite. Oh, am I? My autofocus hasn't been working all that hot lately, but oh yeah, that's definitely quartz in there. And then the calcite's kind of running down along it. But they got into, this is a good vein here. Um, got all these whew, sulfides in here. Really, really echoey. Got VA or VR or something. Um, probably geologist notes. Um, there is this big vein right through here. This is pretty cool. That, uh, sorry for the shaking camera, but a little bit of what looks like probably copper there. First little speck I've seen, but. All right, so that's that. Uh, come on, focus. Uh, yeah, so that's that branch. So I'm going to keep going back out until I get to a, a right-hand branch. Um, and then I'll pick back up with you guys. All right. So we came back out from over here. Um, that was... Turned out to be pretty good. Um, around the corner there, you can see the entrance. And uh, so I'm going to go ahead, and this is that last, um, it was the first left-hand branch, I believe. And so this makes that the last right-hand branch on the way back out. I don't think it's going to be quite as extensive as that other one, because there's no, uh, no, the ties are pretty melted in, I guess. Lots of gravel put down. I haven't seen the pack rat yet, so that means I'm still chasing him, I guess. Kind of zigging and zagging. There he is. And, yeah, looks like it probably faces out right there. Got a little bit of a vein they got into um, right here, but it's definitely a, oh yeah, there's some. Um, definitely a different kind of rock than the rest of it was, 
getting into some of this black flaky stuff. There is the pack rat. Um, God, I'm pretty sure it, it, uh, I'm pretty sure it faces out, otherwise he wouldn't be stopped there. Is that the end? Is that the end, bud? Huh. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's the end. Don't attack me. Oh, there's a couple of them back there. Yeah, they're both trapped there, so that's the end of that. Um, so, anywho, uh, that was a good one. Like I said, there is uh, supposed to be one more at it to this one in a shaft um, and a prospect, I believe. So there's still a little bit of a um, little bit of hope that there might be more of this. Uh, but uh, we'll go ahead and head back out and. Uh, show you guys the rest of what I find up here. All right, I'm up at uh, the upper at it. Um, quite the climb up over this way. Um, other at it, uh, I was about halfway down that hill there. Um, but I saw the waste rock pile here. And it doesn't look, um, that other one didn't look like it would uh, support that amount of tunnels either but um this one looks pretty good looks like it might be open enough to get into oh yeah yep um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and um gear up and slip into this one too um there's supposed to be a shaft i think right over here and i'm wondering if that big huge um hill there is all waste rock um if it is that's uh it's gonna be a pretty deep shaft and maybe this will have a loading station for it or something but um i'll get geared up and get in there all, right, all geared up and ready to drop into this upper at it here i think uh looks like it's gonna be pretty good uh, shouldn't be too bad to in there Accurate nest. There we go. Little pocket here. Um, lots of lots of sticks in here. Oh, what? Huh. A little right-hand branch here, and my boots squeaking at me. That's nothing. And. That is weird. Um, that is really, really weird. So we have this right hand branch here that just goes back to that little pocket, nothing. Um, a little straight ahead pocket here, goes to nothing. And then we have this little pocket that goes to nothing. So I don't know where all that waste rock came from because um, it wasn't that big of a pile, but it was big enough to uh, make me think it'd be bigger than this. So I guess that's it on this one. I'm going to go uh, see if I can find that. Oh, there we go. Oh, hey, bat. Sorry about that. Um, go probably see if I can find that shaft, but I figured I'd show you this first. Nice copper. Um, and then a bat right next to it. So I was gonna get up close and get a nice picture of that copper. There's some more um, peeking out of there. That's pretty cool. Uh, it's actually, yeah, there's quite a bit of that when you look around, but uh, yeah, so I'll go maybe poke around this thing a little bit more. Um, seems to be some pyrite or something in that little vein that could almost make you think it was gold but uh, not yellow enough yeah nice little vein right there so um, but i'll go ahead and pop back out of here and uh show you guys the shaft if i can find run into that all right so i'm up at the uh 
the top of this waste rock dump. Um, where was the, so over there was that last, uh, that upper at it and somewhere down and along that way um, was the lower at it and this is kind of big pile of waste rock I'm up on top of over here and then it looks like there might be a shaft here might even be double um, probably yeah that one is plugged this one doesn't look like it is though I won't get too close. I don't have a. Oh, yeah, down to water right there. Um, but I'm sure it's probably deeper than that. But uh, it's all flooded out. So, um, pretty cool to find, though, still. Um, uh, it's almost looking like there's another waste rock pile above me, though. Check that. Uh,. Yeah, it's kind of hard telling. A couple of areas, I think they're just um, maybe tell a slope or something. Let me run over here real quick. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's just the sun lighting it up to make it look like a waste rock pile. But, um, yeah, so, well, at least we found it that... Uh, that lower at it was uh, way more extensive than I thought it was going to be. Um, especially not knowing pretty much anything about this place. So um, I'll have to do a little research and um, see if I can figure out where I am and uh, what mine this is. And, and uh, thanks again for watching and uh, we'll do it again.